Uh, now, uh, electric vehicles. Um, if you go to a showroom and go and buy an electric vehicle, uh, generally the range which the manufacturer says the vehicle can do on one charge from full to flat is a little bit ambitious, shall we say. So, uh, this BMW i3, for instance, uh, manufacturer says this particular model will do 153 miles, I think, on one charge. And it's claimed that the real world mileage, so like in normal conditions, is 140. Uh, so, we, we've got a simple test that we're going to perform. Now, uh, Trade Skills for you, they reached out to me and they said, um, we challenge you to drive this BMW i3 from their training centre here in Gatwick up the M23. Uh, we're going to go clockwise around the M25. We're going to hook onto the M1 and we're going to end up finishing, hopefully, at their other training centre, which is in Coventry. Total distance 137 miles. Now, the real world conditions this vehicle says it can do is 140. So anybody's raced this? Just looking in the back of the car, they've left the uh, they've left the charging cable in the back. So I'm not sure if that's uh, their way of saying I won't make it. I don't know, but uh, yeah, these cables, these are like if you go onto eBay or somewhere, these are like 300 quid. They are huge money. Um, in fact, I've got a feel. I don't know. Can you remove these while while because I've never owned an electric vehicle? Can you remove these while they're charging? Because I mean, a car could just be charging up, and you could basically just nick the cable and sell it on eBay for a hundred quid. You know. There's also no tow rope in here. I've noticed. So, um, not that I don't. I just know what. Let's just get going and find out. So that's the plan. We've got to drive from Gatwick to Coventry on a single charge of puff. So uh, I'm optimistic. Um, so we're going to get ready. We're going to set our cameras up and stuff and we're going to cue some cinematics. Westwood Way. Westwood Way was selected. No house numbers are available for this street. Do you want to start route guidance? Yes. Route guidance has been started. How do you zoom into this thing? Ah, okay. Right. We're ready. Right. So we've got to put it in drive. Are we moving? <laughs> okay. We're good? How do I put the steering wheel up? All right. Yeah. I feel like I'm sitting on the toilet. This is quiet. It's currently saying I've got... It's being very optimistic. It's saying I've got 198 miles. I, I, I've got a feeling that's going to go down, obviously. Yeah, no wrong turns either. I cannot make any wrong turns. Fucking now. This is also, it's like a little go-kart. Okay, nice slow acceleration. This is a clever balance, because you've got to have just enough, just enough throttle to, to get up to speed, but not too much that you waste energy and then have to hit the brakes. This is a very, this is a clever race. It's a bit boring, mind of you. <laughs> you can't cane it or anything. You've got to be really, really, everybody else is just driving past, you know? Right. I'm going to put my seat back and relax. Oh, the, the regen braking is really impressive. You've literally, you haven't got to touch the brakes. It's very, very clever. That's very impressive. I have not had to touch the brakes to stop at all. I must admit, if this is the future of electric cars, it is quite impressive. Bang the cruise control. Oh yeah, this is the life, yeah. All I need now is a, a vegan sausage roll and that's it. <laughs> right, so yeah. Do you know exactly where you are in the country then? Uh, we are... <laughs> uh, we're just coming up to Junction 17 on the M25. Junction 17? Yeah, that's the Rickmansworth turn-off. That's where we are currently, yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. And according to the sat-nav, how many miles to go? Okay, we've got 93 miles to go and it's saying I've got 100 miles left on my battery. So it's, it is starting to tighten up a little bit. <laughs> I'm not as optimistic yeah. as I once was. It's starting, the gap's closing yeah. now. 
It is. I mean, I think you had last time we spoke. I think you had like a, it was like a forty mile, thirty or forty mile safety net there. Yeah, that that's, that's gone that, now. The problem is, I put it into I put it into sport mode, and that hasn't really helped because it was getting a bit cold in here. So I've turned the heating on. That was a bit of a silly thing to do <laughs> because that, that's that's not helped my my economy now. Okay. All right. Well, you're learning as you go. That's good. <laughs> Very much. Yes. Eventually. Fucking now. All right. That was a journey. It did it. We got about 10% charge left. That is an awesome car, I won't lie. That is impressive. EV technology isn't 100% there yet. But if that's anything to go on, this is where the future is going to go. This is without a doubt. That is, I've just managed to drive from Gatwick all the way to Coventry on one charge without any issues at all. And there's other cars out there now which can do, you know, Teslas, they can do double what this can. And this already is a very capable little car. So if the technology, if this is anything to go by, I'd say this is pretty impressive.